Huh? Who among you shall go next? Wait, what? Really? That just throws me right back. All right, let's go again. Hey, you're my favorite. I know, I know, I know. Yeah. Well, I know I've made you a paranoid, Ted. I know you're scared. But okay. So, hmm. No, I. Yeah, we can't use the path here. Nothing really with the arrow that we can do. Oh, by the way, we haven't we haven't looked at the psych profile. Psychological framework, a paranoid personality is characterized by delusions of grandeur, suspicions of plots, and heightened feelings of anxiety and jealousy. I see. Oh wait, the arrow is gone. No, it's still here. It's just not showing up. That's strange. The arrows. Yeah. It's just not not rendered in for whatever reason. Video screen. Okay. I say. So if we press the wrong one, it just sends us right back, huh? Let's go for the clown. I never liked going to Ah, uh, push it. Push it. Not use it. Push it. Come on. Ah. Uh, who am I? So what's the point of that? Are we just going to go through all of the screens until something yeah. happens? Is something going to happen? I know. Because we might as well. It's not that many of them. But I wonder if there's any rhyme or reason to it. Videos. Why? Say. So we haven't tried the three in the middle yet. So let's go for the castle. Oh, there we go. Because it wasn't another. Am plotting this time. Right. Here alone. Still, I feel as though I'm being watched. Okay. Because the castle was in the other, in El Ellen's thingy. So, all right. What do we have here? Gargoyles. Gargoyle is even larger than those of Penelope's estate in the Hamptons. Oh, in the Hamptons, you say? All right, can we talk to the gargoyles? Really? Come on. Can we push them? It's been two lifetimes since I've performed manual labor. It doesn't matter. <laughs> the statue is solid stuff. All right, can't use them either, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, looks like... Oh, look at that. There's eyes looking at us here. Ooh, that's creepy. So let's uh, look at the drawbridge. This old drawbridge is in ruins. I don't trust it to hold my weight. Oh come on! Can we take it? This is many you. <laughs> Can we use it? There's no way to raise the drawbridge. The Why would I raise it? Can we talk to it? Can we push it? There's no. The All chains right. Are what else can we look at? Nothing else, right? The entrance over there. Oh. Well, he just said it wouldn't hold his weight. You little bastard. Okay, um, anything else though? No. Use the entrance. Walk to the entrance. All right. <laughs> so typical of the castles I've visited in Europe. A beautiful <laughs> facade disguising ordinary stone. Uh, Appearance is everything. It's just typical. Look at some stuff. Tapestries. Why, that maiden looks just like Ellen. She seems so sad and so beautiful. Oh. All right. So many women have called me their knight in shining armor, <laughs> but never Ellen. Good God, this Ted guy is a handful, huh? Armor. I never realized that a knight's armor was so heavy. How were they mm. ever able to fight? Mm. The door away. There's a couple doorways here. There's a good bunch of doorways, actually. Nothing else up here. Okay, I suppose we can't People use the armor, much right? shorter in the Middle Ages. I'd never be able to fit into that armor. Right. We can't push it either, right? The damn doors blocking the way. Wait, the doors blocking the way? Can I push the door? Can I use the doorway? Can I walk to the doorway? 
Okay, apparently not. Oh. Uh, this we... must be the bedroom of the lord of the castle. Hmm. Bed, books, anything else? Doesn't look like it. No one slept in this bed for ages. Sheets are coated with dust. Okay. And I use it. The bed looks comfortable enough, but I'd suffocate on all the dust. Man, Ted, come on. You really don't know how to get a little dust off of some sheets? Can we push it? I used to work out, but I doubt I could move this by myself. Obviously not. Okay. Can we swallow the I bed? I many foul... No. Can't talk to anything here either. Okay. Uh, let's look at some books then, huh? Quite an impressive collection of books. Science, philosophy, tragedy, comedy. Right. Can we take some? Oh, look at that. Don Quixote, Faust, Journal, Mort d'Arthur, Symposium, the Divine Comedy. Let's read Don Quixote. That's actually not I've that bad novel. of a book. It's about a foolish old man who believes he's a knight destined to revive the golden age of chivalry. Right. Okay, let's read all of them. I know this story. It's about a magician who sells his soul to the devil in exchange for power. <laughs> a this journal. Like a diary. Ah, oh, look at that. First, second, third, fourth. The first passage reads, My new wife continues her rapid aging. Each day is as a year to her. I believe that the magic drains her, twists her. Okay. The second passage reads, The incantations I hear from my wife's infernal workroom are the purest evil. Perhaps it is her hatred of my daughter that drives her up there. Hmm. Okay. The third passage reads, Ellen grows weaker and weaker. My wife advises an antidote to her illness, but it lies very far away. I must assemble a caravan. A care. Final passage reads The forest has grown dark and overrun with dire wolves since my marriage. I doubt that even with a full complement of men I shall return alive, but I must try. Okay. This was one of my favorites. It's about how King Arthur assembled the most chivalrous knights in all Europe. All right. This is Plato's dialogue about the nature of love. Mm -hmm. I know this. It's Dante's epic journey through hell, heaven, and purgatory. Okay. I don't know what exactly that did for us. But I guess that's it for this room. Unless... No, I don't think there's anything else. All right. Uh, how do we? Where's the? Where's the way back? Wait. Where's actually? There we go. So what's over here? Oh, it's Why Ellen. It's Ellen. Did Am tell her that I loved her? <laughs> was that the secret he was referring to? I don't know. Can we talk to Ellen? Oh, Ted. I feel so tired. So weak. Did Am do this to you? Yes. Maybe. I, I can't tell. They whisper in my ear, and this bed is so soft. Hey. Can you walk? No, I'm too weak. I haven't been out of this bed in ages. Please hang on, Ellen. Your father went to find an antidote for your illness. That was weeks ago, Ted. My father will never return, with or without an antidote. Oh, Do you no. know if there's a way to escape from this place? I searched the entire castle grounds before I fell ill. There's no escape for me but death. Good God. No, I won't let you die. I can't take this suffering anymore, Ted. The things I've endured help me to die with dignity. Don't let anyone violate me again, not even in death. No, don't go. I need you. We need you. If 
you really care for me, Ted, bring me my hand mirror. Hmm. Why do you want a mirror? My stepmother has been jealous of me ever since she became ugly. She had something to do with my illness. I know it. But she doesn't dare come near me while I have the mirror. Hmm. Where is your mirror? I left it on my dressing table. Bring it to me. Alright. Uh, anything else we can do here? Door away? We can look at Ellen. So beautiful when she's sleeping. Alright. A dresser. Perfume bottles, jewelry boxes, but no mirror. Hmm. Perfume bottle. Can we push it? I don't need to push the dresser to see the. <laughs> Alright. There's no mirror, Alan. Ted, please tell me you found my mirror. I have not. Where is your mirror? I left it on my. I looked on your dressing table. Your mirror's not there. You have to find it, Ted. It's okay. the only thing keeping my stepmother away. And it's the only thing that can finally end my suffering. Go back to sleep, Ellen. Yes, sleep. That's what I need. Good God. Okay, so we gotta find a mirror. Let's see here. There's another doorway. There's an evil in this room. I feel evil. it all around me. Okay. I do like this section, though. Ancient this castle is a collection stuff. of books on the black arts. There must be dozens of volumes. Black arts? Let's read those. Demons and their spheres. This is a catalog of the demons ruling the abyss. One of these entries is circled. Sergot, opener of locks. Supposedly, he can open anything. Ho oh, ho. Oh. Okay. Kitab al-Azif. Mm, too bad I can't read Arabic. From the notes in the margins, I gather it has something to do with opening a gate into another world. In search of the Philosopher's Stone. This book seems to be about how to change metals into gold. I've read a fair number of science textbooks, but I can't make head nor tail of any of these formulas. All right. Okay. So, nothing really apparent with the books. Nothing over here. There's some glass on the floor. Glass. Pieces of a broken mirror. Ah. I feel a cold draft blowing across the bed like from an open grave. All right. Um, can we do anything with the glass? Mm, I'd only smear blood on it. Huh. Can we use the bed? If I slept here, I doubt I would wake up again. <laughs> Alright, um, anything else? I used push to it? work out. No. Push the glass? No. It might push back. <laughs> Jesus. Can we push the books? No secret passages here. <laughs> okay. Um, can we swallow some I've books? Eaten many no. We can't talk to anything either. Swallow the glass. I've eaten met No. Alright. So there's a broken mirror here. Nothing really else. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's go out. There's one more passage here. This looks wow. like a chapel, but there's something unholy about it. Hey, you it tell me. The gargoyles. It sure is. So there is. A so unlike Am to provide light when he knows how frightening the dark can be. Uh, he's up to something. Mm. One more. Oh, a sconce. I read that a scone. Why? Sconces. So and three, four of them. Okay. Pulpit. I don't think I want to know what kinds of sermons were preached here. I do. Anything else? I caught. special about this rod except for the ridiculous gargoyle face on top. <laughs> so we can't look at the gargoyles or interact with them in any way. Okay, can I take the icon? Sure can. Nothing special about. All right. So no idea what this does. 
Uh, by the way, can we use the psych profile? Historical data. During the Middle Ages, a knight's code of chivalry emphasized performing good deeds and showing courtesy to women. Hell yeah. Can we take the pulpit? I used to work out. No. Can we push it? I used to work. No. Uh, okay. Can we maybe use one of these sconces? It's bolted to the wall. They're bolted to the wall. Can we push them? I don't think so. Oh! Passage. It's a What's one waiting of them. For me up there? The other one probably doesn't do anything it's either. Bolted huh? to the wall. <laughs> okay. Don't try to push it from the other side of the wall. But, uh, okay, let's go to the secret passage Some sort here. sort of demonic rituals must go on here. What in God's name have I stumbled onto? Couldn't tell you. Circle. Nothing else? Doesn't look like it. Stairs. So that probably goes back up. Okay. Uh, sure. Go right into... No, don't go into the circle. Partially completed circle inscribed with a pentagram. Partially completed. Part of a black ritual. It sure is. Can we use it? I don't know anything about magic. Ah, come on. Can we use the idol, uh, the icon? I don't know anything about no. Can we push the circle? I can't erase it. Hmm. Okay. We can't talk to it, right? We can't swallow it. All right, so there is a secret ritual going on down here. Okay. Let's see. There was one more passage. Or actually, no. I think this just leads outside, right? Does it? Oh, no. Would you look at that? Trappings, I've seen kitchens like this before. A kitchen. This is a place where servants do all the work. Okay. This oven is similar to the boilers I maintain in St. Louis. God, how I hated those days. Anything else? The maid? Aside from the dishpan hands and wrinkles, this scullery maid has quite a body. Certainly oh, Ted, you little. Bed. You sleazeball. So let's uh, talk to her, maybe. Excuse, Excuse me, do you me? work here? Do you work here? Why, of course I work here. Why else would I be plucking this chicken? <laughs> Say, you're a handsome gent. There aren't many men left in these parts. All right. What happened to Ellen? Lady Ellen? Oh, well, she's been ill and that's all I know. It's not healthy to ask too many questions these days. Let's talk about you instead. Hello. Is there a way to escape from this castle? Escape? With all of those wolves in the forest? Well, it's safer to stay in the castle. The beds are very cozy. You should try mine sometime. Good God, she's really going for it. Where is Ellen's stepmother? I must speak with her. A word to the wise. Keep your nose out of the old woman's business unless you want it covered with warts. I wouldn't want to see any arm come to that gorgeous face of yours. Where can I find a mirror? What do you want with a mirror? Those are pretty rare, what with an ugly woman in charge of the castle. <laughs> it was enchanting talking with you. My pleasure. Come back later, and I'll show you just how good I am at pleasure. Oh my. Um, but there was one more option that I didn't. Please, I go. need to find a mirror. And you are what I need. I'll make a deal with you. I will tell you where you can find a mirror if you spend some quality time in my bed. Hmm. How can I possibly refuse such a lovely lady? Uh, let's let's not go that's for that right flattering now. Flattering offer, but because I feel like that's a trap. Interested. I'll give you what you need. Hasn't it been too long for you? I don't know. So, again, I feel like it's a it's a pretty obvious trap for whatever Sorry, reason. Sorry, but it's out of the question. What's the matter? Aren't I good enough for you? Not classy enough? Not rich enough? Yeah, let's go for the for the romantic I'm route. I'm sure here. you're a fine woman, but my heart belongs to another. So, 
You're in love with that thing sleeping in a bed. Have you ever been with one? Or are you just curious? I can make you so much happier. I can, you know. All right. Look, I am not going to make love with you. Oh, all right. I have another deal for you. There we the go. Oven's broken. If you can fix it, I'll get you a mirror. Oh, that sounds better. Okay, cool. We got a broken this oven. This oven is similar to the boilers I maintain in San... God, how I... Can we do something with it? Ah, there's the problem. I'll have this fixed in a jiffy. It's been so long since I've gotten dirt under my fingernails from good, honest work. Did we get it? There we go. Ah, that sound. Cool. Give me the mirror. I fixed your oven. Now where is the mirror? Sorry, I don't know where a mirror is. But at least now I can finish dinner. You little bitch. Why, you used me, <laughs> you bitch. Just like you tried to use me, you snobby what? bastard. I did I not. You've used lots of women with your smug charm. You're nothing but a phony. All right, well, whatever. So I think we're done with her. Please, oh, I need still to talk find a mirror. Well, you did fix the oven. Listen, the old woman knows where the mirror is, but she's afraid of it. She obviously can't get to it herself, or she would have destroyed it by now. Oh. Okay. Where can I find the old woman? Don't worry. She'll find you. No. Can we say we're sorry? Listen, I'm sorry. Don't bother me anymore. I've got to get back to fixing dinner. Okay, cool. I think we're done with her. There's nothing really else. There's two doors, and that's it, right? Looks cool. Okay. Uh, I think we came out of this one, right? Is yeah. Lady Ellen prepared? Oh. Oh. As ready as she will ever be. The spell keeps her body weak, but she will remain conscious. The art of sacrifice is reduced to science. And what of the glamour? We must wait for its removal. It remains beyond our best efforts. Then we wait for a prince. With his help, we can open the gate to the other world. Ooh. Oh, don't go after them. There we go, okay. Uh, let's check that other door in the kitchen first. What is over here? Uh, can you not? Can you... The door's locked. Ah, I see. We need some sort of key. Can we use this? This is about the same size as those door hinges. Hmm. But that can't be a coincidence. So, why don't you do something about it? The door's It's the same size this as is the about hinges. The same size as those door hinges. So, what. What good is this then? Just for science. You better put it back. It wouldn't do for the old lady to Okay. Uh, so no idea what the point of that is. I thought we could maybe use it on it, but apparently not. It's the same size as the door hinges. So we got that info now, for whatever reason. Can we use it on this? I don't know anything about magic. <laughs> Oh, there's another doorway here too, right? Have we actually? Oh, okay. So this just like because they're hungry or because they like to torment their prey. Uh -huh. Um, I don't think there's anything else left here. So let's go back to the entrance here. Hmm. So what else is there now? I guess we're gonna go there. Right. And into the secret passage, maybe? I don't see anything else to do here. So let's see. It's the witch. Yeah, oh, there we go. doing with her hands? Some kind of incantation, perhaps? Well, I don't know. Look what at her. Horrible old witch. <laughs> she seems ready to keel over any second, but it could be fatal to underestimate her. All right. Um, nothing really else. Partially complete. This must be part of 
circle is still partially completed. Can we talk to her? What have you done to Ellen, you old witch? Ah, our <laughs> prince has finally arrived. Now we can begin our ritual. Oh, great. Uh, Why do you call me a prince? Isn't that who you want to be to Ellen? Her prince charming? Sure. I need someone to gain her trust, to break down her defenses. It's a part you played many times in the real world. I like how he just turns around when she speaks to him. What ritual are you talking about? A sacrifice. A trade. Ellen's life in exchange for safe passage through the gate. Okay. What's this about a gate? The gate is a passage into the surface world. It is the only way out of this place. Mm. What's supposed to be my role in this ritual? I need you to destroy Ellen's mirror. She has been using it to keep me away from her. I want you to break it so that I can complete what I have started. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you just want me to break the mirror? It is not that simple. The mirror holds great power. It can be broken only within the magic circle. All right. Why can't you destroy the mirror yourself? I am aging rapidly, and despite my powers, I am a slave to vanity. I can't bring myself to look into the mirror. <laughs> Where is Ellen's mirror? It is on her dressing table. No, it's not. I looked on Ellen's dressing table. The mirror's not there. You must find that mirror. <laughs> it has great magical properties. <sighs> oh, great. Without it, I cannot guarantee that I can complete the ceremony. All right, um... Why can't you open the gate without the mirror? There are others who have an interest in Ellen's fate. That mirror may be the only way to keep meddlers from interfering. Mm -hmm. What if I can't find the mirror? Then go to the devil! Oh! Uh, all right. What's in it for me if I help you? An opportunity to escape Am's tortures forever. I don't believe her. Hmm. Perhaps there's something else I can do for you instead. Perhaps there's something else I can do for you instead. Well, it has been a long time since oh, my God, husband no. left. Oh, if Lord, no. If you can no. satisfy my needs as a woman, then oh. I will help you escape. Oh, oh, we, oh, no. Oh, no. I'm not going to make love to you. I would never betray my love for Ellen. Oh, you do a very convincing job <laughs> of playing Prince Charming. Ham is quite the DM. But I know DM. you better than that. Destroy the mirror and I will let you escape into the surface world. I mean, look at the scenario he thought up here, huh? Frickin' disgusting is what it is. Let me think about your offer. I ought to kill you instead. I really should. Well, well, let me let think me about think it. think about your offer. Do not think too long. The forces at work here are not patient. Right. So can we just tell her I ought to kill you? I ought to kill you instead. Oh, do we fancy ourselves the avenging knight? My magic is much more... Okay. All right. So we need to find the mirror. Let's see. There's these sconces, but I think we're good there. Also... Hmm. Oh, would you look at that? Walk to the devil. Sure. I never <gasps> believed in hell until <laughs> Am captured me. But this devil looks like the real article. He really does. I've seen such dark and mysterious eyes. And he, he won't take like them off Ellen clown. for a second. All right, let's talk to him. I don't know. Hey there. Who are you? I'm a devil, of course. <laughs> Why else would I have this pointed tail? <laughs> and his voice is beautiful, too. What do you want? Ellen's soul. That's a valuable commodity where I come from. All right. Can you tell me where Ellen's mirror is? Sorry, I don't bother with such material things. They only bring about <laughs> bad luck. 
<laughs> I like this guy a lot. Who is this Sir guy? Right? Or Not the voice I was expecting a at all. Spirit, a demon. <laughs> Don't confuse him with those pathetic imps, or heaven forbid, higher order devils. Opener of all locks, indeed. You know, he, he looks and sounds like a used car salesman instead of the devil, huh? It sounds like you really hate demons. You got that right. In fact, the only things we consider worse than those untrustworthy fellows are angels. Mm. How can beings as powerful as yourselves stoop to fighting like schoolchildren? Well, it's like this, big boy. In hell, we do things exactly like you do them here. Or <laughs> maybe the game, game developer hates Adam car sales. Over. I mean, who doesn't? I don't, I don't think I've ever encountered any car salesmen that were, like, really nice, you know? Because they always plot something, you know? Not like they're talking to you and being nice to you just because they're nice human beings, right? You anyway. that Am is in control of hell? Oh, don't look so surprised. Who else could be in control of this madhouse? Only man could create such a monster. Sorry. Sorry. What do you mean that you do things like we do here? I mean that there are always internal struggles, petty conflicts for power. Only in this case, the struggles are between entities that you can't see or might rarely see. That means serious problems for you. <gasps> what problems can these unseen struggles cause for me? You must decide who is your friend and who is your enemy. And remember, with Am's control over morphogenic fields, appearances mean nothing. Well, thank you, devil, for telling me that. Please, go away. Try to understand my position. I can't leave because there's an angel coming to take away her soul. If I step out and your friend croaks, the holy eunuch spirits <laughs> the goods off to heaven. Oh, God. All right, I think on that note, we're going to end it this, this evening because... Uh, it doesn't get much better than this. And we're going to continue to find Ellen's mirror and her soul on the next attempt.